House panel approves $36.5 billion for disaster relief. Washington, Reuters, the U.S. House of Representatives Appropriations Committee has approved $36.5 billion in emergency funding for relief and recovery from the recent devastating hurricanes and wildfires, a spokeswoman for the committee's chairman said late on Tuesday. The bill includes $7 billion more than the White House had sought last week and nearly $6 billion more for the Federal Emergency Management Agency than the administration's request. The committee's bill includes $576.6 million for wildfire efforts, $16 billion for the National Flood Insurance Program and a provision enabling low-income Puerto Ricans to receive emergency nutrition assistance, said Jennifer Hing, spokeswoman for representative Rodney Freling Heeson, the committee chairman. Related coverage House Republicans to take up disaster funding Thursday It was not immediately clear when the bill would move to the floor to be voted on by the entire House. The United States has been battered by a series of hurricanes in the Caribbean, Texas and Florida and wildfires in California. President Donald Trump has also asked Congress to approve a $4.9 billion government loan to help Puerto Rico pay some of its bills in the wake of Hurricanes Irma and Maria. The bill includes up to $4.9 billion in loans for local governments struggling to provide services after recent hurricanes. The loans are intended to be used by U.S. territories which would include Puerto Rico and the U.S. Virgin Islands. Leaders of both major political parties have applauded the bill. Democratic House leader Nancy Pelosi said in a statement on Wednesday that emergency funds should not be siphoned off for bondholder payments which echoes the administration's stance. Based on the materials of the site, 